Hello, I welcome you again to another episode of Before You Take the Stage. My name is Ola Bindi, and don't forget that our previous episode also explains more on the topic that we are on. That is chapter three, that is to identify the people around you. And today we are checking an, another subheading, which is Bezalel and Aholiab. It might sound very strange to some of you that are not really deep in the scriptures, but uh, you know, I said in the subsequent episode, that is the one that actually starts the chapter three, I said we'll be looking here into some scriptural characters. And one of them is what we want to examine today, Aholiab and Bezalel. I want us to read with me, that is Exodus chapter 36 verse 1. Exodus 36 verse 1, it reads, says, Then wrote Bezalel and Aholiab, and every wise-hearted man, in whom the Lord put wisdom and understanding to know how to work all manner of work for the service of the sanctuary, according to all that the Lord had commandment, commanded. Rather. Now, I want you to understand that God gave Moses a mandate to construct the tabernacle. But God himself knew that indeed the mandate has been given to Moses. But to carry it out, that is to construct the tabernacle. Moses cannot do it all by himself. So by this, he had to put his wisdom of how to construct the tabernacle into some men. Now, these men are like destiny helpers to Moses. Without these destiny helpers, it will be very, very difficult for Moses to achieve the purpose of God for his life. Same thing also goes to you. Now, the purpose that God has set before you, there are some people that God is going to please around you that will help you achieve that purpose. Now, the problem remains the fact that if you are unable to identify them, and it does not only end there, the most important thing is that as you are identifying them, you must ensure that you treat them appropriately. Fine, God has instructed Moses, has given him the limelight of who to use for the work of the tabernacle which is Haoliab and Bezalel. He was telling him there that he has imputed in them the spirit of wisdom and understanding. Now, it's a different thing that God showed him. It's another different thing that is not yielding to the voice of God. Same thing also applies to you. At times, God might be showing you some people that you need to work with them so that you'll be able to achieve your purpose. But the problem now comes if you are adamant, which means if you are obedient to the instruction of God. And if you are obedient, if you are disobedient, rather, to the instruction of God who always affect you um, towards achieving the purpose of God for your life. So it is very important that you identify them so that you will treat them up appropriately. So I'm telling you also that you have people like Haolia and Bezalel around you, which will help you to actualize the purpose of God for you. So please, as you are identifying them, make sure you treat them appropriately. And I'm quite sure that if you should do that, there will be no cause for you to regret. Thank you very much. I pray that all these episodes that you have been watching will be blessed with them. Thanks for the likes, for the shares, and for the comments. See you in the next episodes.